Unleash the Fury. Welcome to War Gear Reviews Tech Reviews coming to you from rainy old England and today we're about to unleash the beast. And what beast is this I hear you say? Well I hear it is the brand new Poco F3. And for those of you not so familiar with Poco, they are a sub-brand of Xiaomi and the Poco F1 was one of the phones that was first titled the flagship killer. It came in at a crazy price point and with monstrous specs and this one is actually the most powerful Poco phone to date. And they seem to be challenging me to see if I have the power to unleash it. As He-Man once said, So now it's time to unleash the beast. And only the smartest can tame this beast. Well, that rules me out then. Only joking, I am quite wisdomous when I want to be. So let's get this out of here. So this beast is so powerful, they've had to padlock it in this box. And now I have to crack the code. And there is a little bit of a hint here. So unleash the beast and then here we have the answers are closer than you think. So what the hell does that mean? So we have claw prints all around the box and claw prints on the front of the box. So that's obviously what the clue is referring to. And right here on the first digit of this claw, we have a five. And then on the third digit, we have a zero. And then on this one, the second digit must be a three. And the fourth is right here. Check this out. There is a three. On there, I don't know if you guys can see it there. There is a three. So that must be the code, it has to be the code. So let's do this. We've got five. The second digit was three. Third digit was zero. And the last digit has to be that three that was on this box, has to be. There we go, and we're in. It's time to unleash the fury. Unleash the fury. Unleash the fury, Mitch. So here we have it, the brand new Poco F3. And there's a lot of very standout features on this phone. I'm not gonna go through all of them today. I'm gonna to unbox it for you guys, highlight some of the key features and show you guys some camera samples. So stick around for those. And here's a little message from Poco. And it says, you have onboarded Poco's mission of everything you need and nothing you don't. This phone is designed and tailor-made for tech enthusiasts who appreciate every bit of technology that enables daily life to be easier. And that sounds good to me. Check that out. That is an analog to USB-C dongle in the box. Plus your usual literature. Your classic clear case. and the Poco F3 itself. First thing I noticed picking this up is it's got a nice weight to it, but it's also incredibly thin. Let's put that to one side for a second. 
And this phone does come with a power brick. Wow, this is nice. Look at that back. That's Gorilla Glass 5 on the back and Gorilla Glass 5 on the front. And I heard that the punch hole on this particular phone is one of the smallest on any phone. All right, so now we got the beast out of the box. Let's run through some of the key specs that you need to know about this particular phone. So the Poco F3 is rocking a brand new chipset. It's the Qualcomm Snapdragon 870. And check this out, last year, everybody thought Qualcomm were gonna drop the Snapdragon 875, and they didn't. They released the 888, which is now the highest level flagship out there. And the 870 is one below that but one above the 865 from last year. So this on paper should outperform devices like the Galaxy S21, making the Poco F2 another flagship killer. And if you're wondering about RAM and storage options, you've got a six gigabyte variant, an eight gigabyte variant, 128 gigabyte storage and a 256 gigabyte storage. And the great thing about this phone is it has an amazing display on it. It's a 6.67 inch, 120 Hertz OLED that supports, check this out, 360 Hertz touch sampling. You've also got 360 mic pickup. So no matter which way round the phone is, the audio is gonna be very clean. And there's another 360 feature and it's the 360 ambient light sensor. So this will detect light around the device and adjust the screen's brightness accordingly. That should save battery. And that's important when you have 120 Hertz display. And the battery inside is huge, it's 4,520 milliamp hours. And this charger that came with it in the box is 33 watts fast charging. And the primary shooter on the back is a 48 megapixel sensor. You've also got an eight megapixel ultra wide and a five megapixel telephoto lens. It does support dual SIMs and it has an IR blaster. The front and back glass is Gorilla Glass 5 and I am gonna be using this as my main phone for a while. And I have to say, I really like how they've toned down the Poco design just a bit. And I really like the finish they've gone with and I like the fact that the logo is very minimal this time, which is fantastic. And did I mention this beast is 5G? So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick unboxing and quick summary of this device. I will be testing it out. Let me know if there's any particular videos you wanna see with the Poco F3 and I will do my best to make them for you. And if you haven't subscribed, do it! And you will be one of the finest subscribers known to man. I'll see you guys in the next one. Appreciate you guys. Don't be late. Unleash the fury!